In general, a physician owes legal duties to a patient only after a physician-patient relationship is formed. However, once a physician-patient relationship has been formed, the physician owes continuing duties to the patient, such as duties regarding the patient's consent, privacy, and care, unless and until the relationship is terminated. Thus, the beginning and end of a physician-patient relationship are important bookends for determining a physician's legal duties and potential liability, and it's equally important to determine how and when those events occur. In this lesson, we'll discuss just the first bookend, the relationship's formation. We'll cover the termination of a physician-patient relationship in a separate lesson. Generally, a physician-patient relationship is formed when both the physician and the patient voluntarily consent to form a relationship. Although this definition may sound simple, determining whether the parties have voluntarily consented is a fact-intensive, sometimes complicated inquiry. Because patients are viewed as the more vulnerable party, the factual inquiry typically focuses on the physician's conduct. A physician impliedly agrees to form a physician-patient relationship with someone if the physician accepts the person as a patient, agrees to accept the person as a patient, or affirmatively undertakes some action to provide medical care for the person. Sometimes, a physician-patient relationship is formed as early as when the physician accepts an appointment from a person for the purpose of treating that person. For example, in Lyons v. Grether, a blind woman made an appointment to see a doctor to be treated for a specific condition. When the woman arrived at the office, the doctor refused to allow her guide dog in and ultimately refused to treat the woman. The doctor claimed he could refuse to treat the woman because he didn't have a physician-patient relationship with her yet. But the court ruled that the doctor and the woman had formed a physician-patient relationship when the woman made the appointment because that was the point at which the doctor had agreed to accept her as a patient.